Hello, I'm Rob with ScrappyDoo.com, and I hope you're ready for another great tutorial. Alright, so this is another one of the click, create, and cut with Make the Cut software tutorials. And in this tutorial, we're going to show you how you can export an SVG file from what you created within the Make the Cut software. So let's go ahead and get started. I'm just going to go ahead and use this. It's a mixture of, uh, of an auto trace right here, the, the Cricut bug, as well as some different fonts that we, that we used in order to create this. So uh, one of the first things you're going to need to notice is when you select something, a red box goes around it. And that, uh, that's the object properties box. And what we need to do is we need to enable the shape magic because we need to join all the things that we want in order to export this SVG. So what we need to do is we can click and drag a box around everything and as you can see as we highlight the blue box that blue dashed line that means we can perform shape magic and by doing that all we have to do is go to the edit we can go down to shape magic and we need to go to join and that's going to turn everything the same color and when I click on it a big huge red box uh, goes around everything on here and that is that red box symbolizes what we can export as an SVG. Now next all I'm going to do is uh, you can either go to the edit menu or you can go ahead and right click and go to export and then you go to 2 SVG and when you do that a box will appear it will ask you where you want to uh, store it. I'm going to store it right here in the SVG export and I'm just going to call this create and I'm going to hit the save button and uh, when I do that, that message right though there will appear. So all right, so let's go ahead and check out our SVG uh, export that we created. Uh, here's the folder. Here's the create um, file that we created, and I'm just going to double click that to open that into Inkscape. And if you don't have Inkscape installed, you can go to Inkscape.org and install it. And as you can see, it uh, it opened up just fine, and it has everything all nice and neat on the file. So as you can see uh, that this software make make the cut can export an SVG file so you can go ahead and share this with uh, whoever you wish and different cutting devices. So that's another great feature that make the cut uh, has.